Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Lux SMP. I hope all of you guys are doing absolutely fantastic. So in today's episode, we are actually going to be doing a scavenger hunt. Um, I do believe that the scavenger hunt was done by Cat. Yes, it's right here. Cat's New Year's scavenger hunt. Um, so we're going to be doing this today. It should be really, really fun. Um, I've heard that it's very long or that you have to do a lot of running around. So I have plenty of food on me. So I think we should be good. Um, but it just says, please replace the books into the chest when finished reading. So this is the New Year's scavenger hunt. So I'm excited to see what this says. It says, hi, and welcome to Cat's New Year's scavenger hunt. This hunt is all about New Year's resolutions that people try to keep. Try your best to guess the answers. In each chest, you'll find the clue for the next answer. Good luck. All right, so here's clue number one. This resolution is typically one that everyone tries to achieve. Usually when trying to lose weight, you try to avoid a place that sells fries. Ooh, okay, so that's like a fast food restaurant. I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is Peachy's new restaurant, which I have actually not shown on camera yet. So, this will be the first time that you guys will actually see the new restaurant. Um, so let's head down here. I mean, I hope that this is where it's at. Um, I'm pretty sure it is, but we're gonna find out. Um, yeah, this is Peachy Days Fries and Shakes, so I think that this is it. Before the ones of you who have not seen this shop yet, this is what it looks like. Uh, there's these little stools up here, and there's milkshakes, burgers, and french fries that you can buy. And you just throw your gold over the counter, which is really cool. Um, this is a really cool looking stage that she has set up, and it looks like this was clue number one. Nice, okay. Um, so it says, congrats, you found clue number one, clue number two. Another resolution people try to keep is to drink lots of water. Now, where can we find lots of water at spawn? Ooh, um, I have a couple of ideas for this one. Okay, so my guess is down here at the Diamond Bay. At least I, I hope it is, um... I think that there's a chest over here. What does that say? Clue number two. Yes, this is where it was at. My guess was correct. All right. Clue number three. People like to work out and eat right to feel good. Some people drink milk to improve the strength of their bones. Now, what at spawn reminds me of milk? Ooh, what at spawn reminds me of milk? Okay, so I'm pretty sure I know where the next clue is at and... I believe it's down here at the newest shop, or actually this really isn't a shop, it's more just like a build. Um, but I did watch this on Kat's newest episode, and she built the compliment carton, which it's kind of like a carton of milk. Um, although for some weird reason, I always want to call this the compliment cartoon. I, I don't know. I don't know why I want to do that. Um, but I came here off camera a few days ago with Malia. Um, so I'm just kind of going to, you know, go over the basis of what the shop is for you guys who do not know already. Um, but it says, welcome to the Lux SMP compliment carton. Please press the dropper button to receive a compliment or other kind words from your fellow SMP members. You can leave compliments too. Take a paper from the chest behind, use the anvil to write something nice, and then drop it on top of the purple carpet. Have a nice day. So um, I actually did do that already. <laughs> I actually got one of these pieces of paper, renamed it to a compliment, and threw it in there. Um, my, my, uh, my compliment was pretty on point, I must say. <laughs> it was really hilarious. Malia seen it. It was, it was a good one. Um, but it looks like this is clue number three, so this was the correct place to go. So, it says, yay, you found clue number three. Now, clue number four. One of the resolutions people hope to retain is giving the gift of love. Many do this by donating to charity. Where would I donate at Spawn? Ooh, okay, so this one's pretty easy, I must say. This is, I'm pretty sure, the giving chest that's 
all the way back over here. <laughs> um, so I guess I will meet you there. Okay, so now we're at the giving chest and clue number four. Perfect. All right. It says, you're doing great. Clue number five. Another resolution people may make is to travel more in the new year. But when you travel, you need a place to stay like... Oh, is this at the hotel? Oh, is this at the hotel? I'm kind of really wondering if it is. Because um, it says when you travel, you need a place to stay at like possibly the hotel. Which if it's at the hotel, I mean... That's exciting. <laughs> um, so we're going to go see about that now. Okay, so here's the hotel. And is this it? Oh my gosh, it is. Okay, I was right. Yes, it actually was in the hotel. Impressive. All right, I'm actually going to sit down here. Okay, um, it says you're really good at finding clues. Clue number six. Ah, love. A resolution some people make is to find love in the new year. And what better holiday than Valentine's? Ooh. Oh, this is cool. Okay, okay, I like it. Um, okay, so my first thought is the holiday land. To the land of the holidays. Alright, so let's see possibly if there's something over here by the Valentine's. Yes, there is. Okay, right by the Valentine's Day Teleport. Alright, it says, is Spawn beautiful or what? Yes, it is. <laughs> All right, clue at number seven. Another resolution people try to keep is staying in touch with family and friends. They do this by meeting up in a very central place. Oh, is this the spawn, like the center of spawn? That's what I'm thinking. So I'll we'll have to go all the way back to the middle of spawn. All right, is this it? Yes, maybe, maybe so. Is it up here? um clue clue number seven yes okay here we go clue number eight um okay took you long enough <laughs> i love how that says that. it's just like took you long enough all right that's nice okay clue number eight my friends have this resolution of taking adventures one of those is mountain climbing Ooh, is this going up the mountain that would be pretty cool. Shall we go up the mountain, guys? You know what? Spawn is truly beautiful. Like, I, I don't know. Like, this this whole setup just kind of amazes me sometimes. Like, the, the mountain and, like, how much work went into it. I don't know. It's just amazing, honestly. It's so, so beautiful. <laughs> um, but let's see here. You know what? I... Bet that it's on up here a little bit because it did say mountain climbing, so we're probably gonna have to climb the mountain a little bit. So let's see if it's on up here. Oh, 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 there it is. Clue number eight. I got it. Yes. Okay, it says, Woo, what an adventure. That it was. Uh, clue number nine. One resolution I'm just dying to keep this year is going skiing in the snow, only it doesn't snow at spawn. But you can buy some at this place. <gasps> oh, is this my igloo? Oh, I bet it's my igloo at spawn. Oh, we're going to have to go there now. All right, I'm excited. <laughs> All right, we're going to head to my igloo now. Okay, now we're coming up on the igloo. Let's go inside and see if there is a clue. Uh, is this it? Yes, clue number nine. Perfect. All right. It says, brr, it's cold here. <laughs> uh, clue number 10. Another resolution people attempt to retain is being careful about spending. Where is a place we go to save money? Um, I would honestly say the bank, more than likely. So let's, uh, let's head to the bank and uh, let's see if there is a clue there. I wonder what this is though, just real fast out of curiosity. Throw payment down here. Is this like an adoption thing? Um, I think Julia was working on that. Don't know why there's two pieces of dirt missing there. Um, but I think uh, Julia was working on that earlier when I was on. Not exactly sure though. Um, let's see. Any clues anywhere? Is this it? Yes, clue number 10. Perfect. 
All right, it says, how many clues are there? Clue number 11. One of my resolutions is to stay out of trouble this year. If I don't, I'll probably end up behind bars. Oh, that's the jail or the sheriff's office. I don't think we've officially built a prison yet, so it'll be the jail, um, which I think Squiggles built, if I'm not mistaken. Because I think that there's a sign in it that says Chief Squiggles. <laughs> um, so I believe the jail is over here. We're going to go check that out. Is this it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that this is it right over here. Um, really cool little build, though. Is this it? Yes, police station. Okay. Uh, jail cells. So is it back here? Yes, clue number 11. Perfect. All right says, well, isn't this cozy? Uh, clue number 12. Some people are very afraid of heights. Some are afraid of the dark. I'm afraid of teapots, so I'm trying to break that fear for my resolution this year. Oh, that's... That, <laughs> it's kind of funny, but kind of not, because it kind of talks about the fear of heights and stuff, but Cat died. Her first death was from the teapot, I think. If was that her first death? I know she died from the teapot. And I, I can't remember if that was her actual first death or not on the server. But I, I do remember she fell off of the teapot and died. Um, so I'm pretty sure that that is where I am supposed to go. Okay, is the next clue in here possibly? Maybe. Oh, wait. I see something over here. Is this it? Clue number 12. Yes, it is. Perfect. Who uses doors to build a bridge anyway? Um, the amazing and lovely cat does. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so clue number 13. Another resolution people try to keep is maintaining communication with those around them. Where at Spawn do we all communicate with each other? Ooh, where do we all communicate with each other? I would think that that would be the message boards. Okay, I don't remember seeing it at this uh, board, so maybe it's at this other one. Let's go check. Is that a chest? I think I see a chest down there. Let's see. Clue number 13? Yes, okay. Uh, it says, you look kind of funny running around like that. P probably. <laughs> All right, clue number 14. One of my New Year's resolutions is to learn how to do my makeup better. But first, I need to buy some at this place. Who is this the mall? Oh, see, I'm showing off all the new builds at Spawn that I have not showed off in my episode yet. Um, so this is the new mall that Kat and Lex have built, which I think is amazing. Um, I have actually not claimed a store in this build just yet, because honestly, I don't, I don't have any ideas at the moment. <laughs> uh, but eventually I will. Uh, but there's like Cat's Clothing. This is Lex's Jewelry Store. And then, was it? Oh, yes, right here. Squiggles Blush and Body, which is like a little makeup store. And here is clue number 14. How awesome. Uh, it says, aren't you pretty? <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this so much. Um, all right, so clue number 15. One of my New Year's resolutions is to hike up to the top of the mountain this year and not pass out from exhaustion. Isn't that the truth? Um, okay, so would that be the, um, what is it called? The, <laughs> the city hall? I'm kind of thinking it's the city hall because it said to hike all the way up the mountain, which all the way up at the mountain would be city hall. So that's, that's kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, luckily, though, we actually have a teleport button, so that shouldn't be too difficult. Is this it? Clue number 15. Yes. Okay, perfect. Um, it says, the view sure is nice up here. Uh, clue number 16. A resolution many gamers try to achieve is getting more sun. Maybe a trip to this monument would give uh, me a little color. Um... That one's super easy. <laughs> that is, I think it's called the Sun Temple, I think. Because I think in Season 1 it was there was a Sun Garden, but I think this is called the Sun Temple. I always get confused about this. I don't know, but it's this this thing right here. <laughs> this is like my favorite build at Spawn, I swear. Um, sun Temple, yes, this is what it's called. 
All right, and let's see over here. Clue number 16. All right, it says you've made it this far. Yay! Clue number 17. Your final resolution is to not regret any mistakes you may make this year. But usually when we make a mistake, we try to fix them. Where would we get things fixed at spawn? Oh, okay. I like these resolutions, by the way. Like... <laughs> they're funny, but they're actually pretty true as well. Um, so I believe that where to get things fixed would be Lux and Cat's, like, fix-it shop. Um, I'm pretty sure. At least I, I hope so. <laughs> We're about to find out now. Um, is this what it's called? Yeah, fix it. Fix it up. Let's see. Clue, clue number 17. Whoa, there's a lot of gold blocks. Okay. <laughs> oh, it says you did it. Hopefully you kept all your resolutions. Thank you for doing my scavenger hunt. I'm not very good at making these, but I thought I'd give it a go. Have a wonderful new year and 2017. For completing the scavenger hunt, you get to take two gold blocks as a prize. Please be honest and only take two. I will know if you took more than two. LOL, cat. Oh, that's so awesome. But cat did an amazing job. She says she's not very good, but like she is. <laughs> so I'm just going to take two gold blocks. There we go. And actually... I, I don't know why this aggravates me so much, but, like, it's uneven. There we go. I just fixed the evenness because that just drives me crazy, I swear. Um, all right, so we got two gold blocks, which is amazing. And you guys should go thank Kat for making this amazing scavenger hunt. It was brilliant, and she did a fantastic job. I'm going to put these two gold blocks in there. And also, before we end off this episode, I know it has been a little while, but a few episodes back, I got you guys to suggest some names for the skeleton horse in my igloo shop, which sells all the snow and the snowmen and all that. Um, but I finally now have the chance to actually name that horse. So we're going to use this anvil here. And the most highly suggested name was actually Snowflake. So that is what we're going to be naming the horse. Make sure that that's spelled right. Snowflake. Yes. Okay. So we're going to go to my little igloo shop and we're going to be naming him Snowflake. But also, guys, for the next episode, I need a another name suggestion for another horse that's in the igloo. <laughs> Um, so I'll kind of show you guys what I'm talking about here because I actually have two skeleton horses in my little igloo here. So we're just going to be naming one of them, uh, Snowflake today. So we'll, we'll do, we'll do you. You seem worthy enough. Here you go. Three, two, one. Snowflake. Yay. Wait, why is there a dog? There's just a random dog in here. Okay, that's weird. <laughs> but we have Snowflake, and if you guys would, down in the comments below, suggest some names for this other skeleton horse, and I will be naming him in the next episode. And I don't know why there's a dog in here, but apparently he's mine now, so... Huh. Okay, well, you can follow me, I suppose. And that is where I'm going to end off this episode. So if you guys did enjoy, be sure to leave a like down below. And I will, of course, see you guys all again next time. Goodbye!